Secretary, Senator Cunningham, members of the world press. See this rock? It's solid matter, right? But in point of fact, the solid parts of this rock, the neutrons, quarks, protons, and electrons, comprise only about one quadrillionth of its total volume. The rest of this rock is actually only empty space. That if solid matter were mostly just empty space, a person should be able to discover a way to travel inside things. We at the Banzai Institute have at last found that way. We have created a device called an oscillation overthruster, which systematically uh, reorders matter by uh, annihilating electrons, positrons. Oh, I get it. What you're saying is that oppositely charged particles collide and blow each other up in a burst of energy, like a tiny big bang, like a, 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 a baby bang. Oh. <laughs> well, I'm probably just uh, stating the very obvious. Shut up. No, 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 it's not obvious at all. If it was obvious, everybody would be doing it every day. See, by all accounts, it appears as though I literally went right through a mountain. And yet this living organism came out of that mountain in Texas with me, even though I was never inside that mountain. The president's calling you, Buckaroo. President of what? The president of the United States. Oh. Would we have the first right, please? What about the Pentagon? The possibility of war in the eighth dimension, Mr. Secretary. What? Mr. President. What's he writing? Conference room! There they are. Don't you see him? What do you mean? Who? Evil! Pure and simple from the eighth dimension! 